Hey, YouTube Jack's back. We have three $30 tickets. All of them. That good old number 13. We know how much we like that. Now we're going to get a little bit inside baseball. We're inside the lottery here on the $30 tickets, which I like to play. As you can see, this is the remaining top prizes. Print out. I got that at Unimart in Reynoldsville. Tells you where it's from at 9 22 and 25 seconds july 24th and these are the remaining top prizes and from what i understand as soon as a claim form is filed for one of these prizes it comes off if you go to the lottery site the lottery website a lot of times they are not up to date and i wanted to make the case in point here is to show you that down here on the break the bank game five dollar one that just came out it's already down to nine mm -hmm. if you go to the website it shows ten prizes ten top prizes remaining so the website is behind the terminal printout so if you really want to know what the top prizes are and that's the one we really want to win is the top prizes you need to go to the website i learned something today that this is now six top prizes on the three million dollar pennsylvania club it started with five. So if it says six there, that means they added more tickets to the game. It doesn't change the odds because they add, there used to be six million tickets for five top prizes. So they added another 1.2 million tickets to the print run to add one more top prize. So is that one a better one to play than the three million cash down here that only has one prize left? Or are you better off playing the $3 million Diamond Dazzler, which has four prizes left? That depends on how lucky you feel. The odds on finding the $3 million win are 1 in 1.2 million on all three games. It doesn't change, I don't believe, at all. The odds on the back of these games, where everybody sees it going, this is 1 in 2.94, and this is 1 in 2.93, and then you got 1 in 3.06. The odds are terrible in this game. It's not really any different. I mean, that's such a minuscule amount over that big of a print run. It's just because on this game here, it has 100 and $150 prizes in every book, you know, one or the other. And it's, that's going to make the odds a little higher because they're not having as many prizes that, you know, are... The Extreme Green had no prizes between 1000 and 50000 so you either got your claim ticket was going to be a thousand, or it's going to be fifty thousand or more. There was no five thousand, ten, or two fifty thousand, two hundred fifty thousand. Like most of these have a two hundred fifty thousand dollar prize on them. So which one am I going to play? I'm going to play this one because I think this is my best odds. Since they just released it, another piece of run. There's going to be more of the five hundred and two hundred dollar winners possibly to get on this one, or three hundred dollars. I never got along with this game. Three million cash. Best odds of winning a thousand dollars, but I sure haven't seen it. It's been, you know, not, I haven't played as much. I don't even buy it very often. This just happened to be my 13 pile, so I brought it out to play. And this doesn't, you know, as I showed you, it does not just have to do with the $30 tickets. If you're a five dollar player and you want to play that new one, it's already in a nine. If you go back up to the next five dollar game, The Wizard of Oz, there's eight. Still eight top prizes left on it. Now you get up to winner, winner, chicken dinner. There's only six left. That's a pretty popular game. It's done good. Bonus cash. I think that's a bingo. It has six left. That's one. No, bonus cash is a $2 game. It still has six left. And if you get into the $20 games, it's a $1 million spectacular. Somebody's already got it. That one sold off the $3 million Diamond Dazzler was sold in Catanning, PA. I saw that on the news. Maximilian only has two top prizes left. Come down here to, I think this is the $1 million. See, they both start out with $1 million. I'm not sure. Which game that's the Money Mania or if it's the Cash Club. I'd have to look at the... Yeah, I have to look at the ticket numbers on the back. Let's see if I find one of them. There we go. There's the Money Mania. I have one of these laying around. I have tickets laying everywhere. I should do something with those, like scratch them. Uh, 1386 is Money Mania, so 1386 still has three prizes left. 
As you can see, there's a six there. It started with five. So they again issued however many. I think it's still 1.2 million on these. It might be a little less. It might only be 1.05 million tickets. You know, something like that. But if you're playing and you want to win the top prizes, there's still two left on the $1 million cash club. And the bonus star millions up here still has one left. And I can't even tell you if there's any bonus star millions out there. Where they are, I don't know. I suppose somebody could have missed the top prize and threw it away. Always a possibility. All you guys from Pennsylvania, if you want to know how many top prizes are actually left, go get the terminal. Hopefully the person there working will know how to get to this. It's under instant games, and then it shows remaining top prizes. It's pretty easy to get to. Pretty painless, too. Now, we're going to start with the Pennsylvania Club because it's the oldest, and it's the one with two left yet. Now, if you don't know how this is played, and you're not from Pennsylvania, we're, we're getting into some scratching now. You're going to be happy. We're going to be going with the PA symbol. The club symbol is the win-all. Or, yeah, the keystone symbols win all, and the club symbols, the three million win. These days, I'll get that keystone symbol and think I won three million. Okay, bonus up here where you can win a money amount, find that amount, win that amount. Pretty simple there. And we have 25 numbers. I wonder what this is. It looks like a coin of some kind. Ah, we'll use this one to start Republic of Chile, Libertad. 1973, 10, 1986, 10 pesos. What was 1973 all about? Something going on there in the front. Yeah, so 73. Uh, something must have happened down there to their commemorating in Chile. No, I'm not looking it up. Let's just go ahead around the horn here and see if we can find one of those aforementioned symbols. We did. We got the PA symbol. Hopefully we find a win. Another PA symbol would be nice because that means we're getting three or four. There's no two PA symbols on this game. And I've only found multiple PA symbols one time, and I've played a lot of these. One, eleven, twelve, and thirty-nine. No sign of those. The dreaded 40. I don't know if you can get PA numbers. I don't think you can. 3, 19, 26, and 40. 33. Let's try these ones here. 5, 38. 10, 9. Well, we had a chance to get another PA, too, because 37 is out. 14. We can get bonuses in PA, though. So let's go up there and see if we can find something nice. Now, yeah, so much for that. Let's see what we got under our PA symbol. Well, that looks like a $40 winner. Since I like to sneak up on it the other way. Now, this is the cash club. Or no, this is 3 million cash. Yeah, 3 million cash. You find that symbol, you win the prize. It's the cash symbol. Find a 30 times symbol, you win 30 times the prize. 30,000 symbol. You got that pretty plain and simple there. 30,000, that's a win all vault. If you want to win $3 million on this, it's going to be under a single number match. We're going to try to see if we can find something under the bonus section first. It plays just like the top, a matching number game. Number eight. Last time I did one of these, I won, Mike got a $100 win for 50 50 each. We each got 50 on one of these tickets. I scratched for him after he sent me some fan mail. Well, we didn't get an eight, so it would be nice to have an eight with another hundred dollar win under it. I don't look like it. No, we're gonna have to depend on the meat of the ticket. Now, let's get rid of this Chilean coin and let's grab something else here in the line of a penny, elongated type Revenge of the Mummy. Universal Studios Hollywood. That's got to be old. Maybe it's a new one. I just don't know they have one. Do not do amusement parks. I don't do much of anything. Work. Play. Not get anything done. 
Well, so much for that. No symbols. Two twelve, eighteen, and thirty six. Two and twelve. Twenty two. Eighteen thirty six. No. Sixteen, seventeen, nineteen. Three, seven, twenty, and thirty nine. Almost looks like the only time I can win on this ticket is when I'm giving money away. 3, 7, 20, and 39. Don't see any of those. Now, yeah, let's try another one. 29, 39. Well, number one, that's not good. Okay, 14, well... You know, like I said, I don't like this ticket. It doesn't like me. I don't like playing it. I really don't. I just don't like that game. Sparkle. Win the prize. Dazzler. Win all the prizes. Three million? You got it. Three million. Up in the description, look, I got a link there to the claim folder with or the claim playlist. I got a folder all the time. I guess it should be called a folder. A claim playlist, and you can see that win there. Up here, we need a cash sign or that money bag for double. Let's go do the bottom first. Round the horn one last time. Still using the mummy coin. I think we'll just stick with this one. Let's see if we can find me the dreaded Florida in the corner. Uh, and there's a little six. So anything can happen now. Oh, sorry about that. I'm losing my grip. Oh, we got 9, 10, 13, and 19. 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 Don't see any of those. Really counting on this ticket to win here. We've got to get something. At least 50 bucks to break even. Twenty-two, twenty-three, thirty-one, thirty-five. 33, 31, 35. No, none of those either. Son of a gun. Gold bar. Lock and the last chance is the key. You get a lock and a key, at least get a win out of it. I've hit that dazzle in the last three spots quite a few times. Or the sparkle, rather. Not the dazzle. You know, the sparkle. I hate sparkle. Stupid name for a symbol. Nothing. Nothing and nothing. That looks like the only one that came through for us. is the one I like the most. Right now, the Pennsylvania Club at least gives me something back. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. So remember... Remaining top prizes from the terminal. Have them print you out one. It says right there, not for sale. They're not allowed to charge you for it. It's free. And you know what's left for sure. Don't trust the app. Don't trust the website. Terminal's a place to find out remaining top prizes. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day.